Yo, what up, this D-Lou, and you're now watching Team Rich TV. So, who is D-Lou? I'm a rapper slash singer from Beaumont, Texas. Got an attitude, yeah, you really got an attitude, yeah, what got into you? Girl, you got an attitude, you been acting crazy lately, what got into you, yeah, girl, you got an attitude, you been acting crazy lately, what got into you, yeah, every time we fight to save my phone, we have no communication. We don't talk. No, it's no. a stable situation. It breaks my heart. Yeah, now yeah. you got my heart resting like a NASCAR. Whoa. Uh, how did I get started? Well, man, it started way back when I was in school, basically. Yeah. I started doing music in school, was in choir, and I used to always play around with music in, in school. And my buddies all be around like, man, you go hard, you know, blase like that. And uh, I just took it to another level when I got out of school and started recording myself. Was I singing at that time? Uh, yeah, actually I was singing at that time. I was in choir, you know. So yeah, I was singing at that time. But I just felt like just, you know, just singing, it was, it was boring. So I always would play around with it, you know. When was my first real studio session? Uh, my first real studio session was like 2006, 2007. Uh, when a couple, couple buddies of mine heard about uh, Jay Reese, a lot of y'all probably know him. Uh, they had a studio back in South End, Beaumont, Texas, and uh, we used to all go in there and we used to just record music, you know, I think it was like $50 a session back then. Back then, I was just freestyling, just having fun with it, you know, uh, paying $25, $50 to do however many freestyles it was, till now, it's like, I take it way more serious, you know, uh, I put my money behind myself and I do all my hooks, sing my hooks myself, you know, uh, do all the rapping myself, or if I got trouble with, you know, as a team, me, Jay Reese, a buddy of mine named Jay, Ghetto G, uh, Fat Boy as well, you know, we sit and we critique it, you know what I'm saying, and we come up with, try to come up with hit records, basically. Nigga don't give me a reason, make me react on the defense. I get you hit by the weekend, all my little niggas be creeping. I had to cross from the deep end, nigga be hating, I'm eating. All of that hatred I'm seeing, trigger figure itch, give me a reason. Yeah. Don't give me a reason, don't give me a reason, don't give me a reason. No, give me a reason, don't give me a reason, don't give me a reason. Don't give me a reason, don't give me a reason, don't give me a reason. No, give me a reason, don't give me a reason, don't give me a reason. Some of you niggas be tripping. Most of you niggas be bitches, I had to call on my senses I had to grind so relentless, I hit the lick and the nigga was timid I keep it simple when hollers up in it for niggas be thinking this shit really sweet I keep it simple when hollers up in it for niggas be playing games in these streets You niggas bitches and you niggas weak, I see niggas die every day in these streets Being a rapper from Beaumont, it's like everybody wanna be, you know, that nigga, you know what I'm saying? Everybody wanna be the top honcho, you know what I'm saying? So if they see you doing music or doing your thing, they don't wanna you know, give you a thumbs up or say, yeah, man, you know, it's cool, or even collab with you, you know what I'm saying, even do music because they want to be that nigga, they want to be that main center nigga, you feel me? And it's just, I don't know, it's just hate to me. The current rap scene in Beaumont, you know, it's like, I mean, it's, 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 it's steady been moving, you know, a lot of artists been, they've been, they've been doing, they've been working, you know, a lot of artists been working for, for, for sure because, you know, of course, you know, Jay put eyes on the city, so a lot of people done turned up now, you know what I'm saying? They trying to get out there and put their work out there now. The females, I mean, you know, I feel like, you know, sex do sales, you know what I'm saying? So I feel like it is easier for a woman, you know, to pop in, the, in, the, in this industry. Well, uh, but fathers, like, are they different with, like, they sound or? I feel like, you know, every every artist around Bowman is different. You know, they got their own unique style, own unique sound. Why do the best rapper little situation get so much attention in Beaumont? Uh Man, really, man, I don't really understand that whole 
scenario really man because really it's, it's no such thing as who the best or, 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 or stuff like that it's about the grind you know what i'm saying she jade out grind you know what i'm saying she out grind everybody really because she, she grind and she did her thing and she and she made it to where she needed to be you know what i'm saying so it's no such thing as who the best you know because everybody got their own person who they like you know this, this in both months, it's stuck on friends. You know, if, if that's your partner, if that's your homie, oh, he the best, the woo, the woo, the woo. Nigga music can be trash like a motherfucker. I don't believe in the trolling and doing all kind of dumb ass shit, you know what I'm saying, just to get your name out there and, and draw attention, you feel me? Because I feel like if you cold enough, bro, and your, your music ought to speak for itself, you know what I'm saying? If, if you dope enough, the traffic gonna come anyway, you know what I'm saying? That's just my point of view looking at this shit. A new study shows that Beaumont, Texas is the least educated city in the country. Oh man, wait until they don't read about this. How do I feel about other people's opinion about Beaumont? Uh, man, I, I really don't give a fuck how they feel about Beaumont, you know what I'm saying? Because you were, if you wasn't raised out here, you know what I'm saying, and came up out here in, in, in Beaumont, you'll never understand us. You see what I'm saying? Because see, we come from nothing. There's nothing out here. You know what I'm saying? It, it, especially with music, I mean, it's nothing. But the education deal is, you know, it's like that's on a whole nother level, you know what I'm saying, with the education thing because of, I feel like it's parenting on that on that behalf because a lot of parents think that they they children friends. You know what I'm saying? And they kids be everywhere. These little youngsters are shooting shit down out here, brother. For real. So I feel like, you know, Kids not having guidance, bro, you know what I'm saying, and, and or, or nothing to do, you know what I'm saying. They they get in the streets, you know what I'm saying. It's, it's so easy to get a gun these days, like like the drop of dime, you can get a gun. And so by them not having no guidance, they get in the street, bro, and, and, and they get to rob and they get to kill it, you know what I'm saying. And then you kidding, and, they, and these youngsters, they killing people that we went to school with, bro. And people, good people that we grew up with, you know what I'm saying, that's not even in that type of lifestyle. And, but they don't know. They don't know who they are. They don't know who they is. They just know they got money or they got something and they want it. You know what I'm saying? Lack of guidance. I do feel like it's important to give back and, you know, talk to the little homies in the hood. You know what I'm saying? Because, see, some 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 kids don't have nobody to talk to or don't have nobody, you know what I'm saying, to, to keep them on their shit. You know what I'm saying? So every time I see a little homie from the hood that I know, you know, I, I'm going to tell him something like, hey, you're doing wrong. When you're fucking up, you're fucking up. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to tell him. So... I feel like everybody should do that. Don't just let these little niggas just wild out, bro. You know what I'm saying? Guide these little niggas. Used to be calm, used to be cool. I was a humble dude. I'm a shark in the water, baby. I'm really in the jungle, too. Used to be calm, used to be cool. I was a humble dude. I'm a shark in the water, baby. I'm really in the jungle, too. Y'all done set up a damn lava. Y'all done set up a damn lava. Live by the gun, you gon' die, boys. Live by the gun, you gon' die, boys. Y'all done set up a damn lava. Y'all done set up a damn lava. Live by the gun, you gon' die, boys. Live by the gun, you gon' die, boys. Y'all done set up a damn lava. Who is my top five uh, artists in the Fold Ninery? Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go with myself, of course. Cause I feel like that. You supposed to always feel like you're the best, and I feel like you know it's me. So I feel like Jay Reese, another one. Heavenly, which is Hevo, y'all know her. You know Jay, she's nice. Ebody, that's five. My music is on uh, pretty much all platforms like uh, Apple Music, iTunes, you know Spotify, stuff like that. You can find all my music. Dilu, Attitude, put it right up on Apple Music. Uh, last words, uh, yeah, I want y'all to be on the lookout for my new uh, album just dropped. It's called uh, Emotional Struggles. Uh, it's on Apple Music as well, like I said before. I want y'all to be on the lookout for my boy Mercy, Mercy Stoner. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can look him up on uh, IG or whatever. Uh, Jay Reese and Mercy Stoner got some, some fire that's going to drop any minute now. Uh, Y'all look, y'all be on the look to work, you know what I'm saying? Fat boy, fat boy all the way live with the beats, you know what I'm saying? He helped me out a lot too. Uh, 100 as well. 100 another artist out here in Beaumont that's real, 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 real live, you know what I'm saying? Y'all be on the look for that boy because he been putting in work too. And my boy, uh, uh, Push Boy, uh, he live too, you feel me? He grinding hard, hard, hard right now. Uh, and um, I want y'all to free my boy, uh, K King. And free my nigga quiz, you know what I'm saying? And earn the E, feel me?
Yo, what up? This D Lou. You've been watching Team Rich TV.